Hello everyone, this is Inside Excel, your best friend. Today, we are going to do some experiment with the GPT-2, especially the TensorFlow 2.0 version. So why this project? Why this? Okay, it, it is simply because it is a TensorFlow 2.0 version. I can't imagine if you use 1.0 because um, it's not the default uh, version when you pipe install the TensorFlow. So um, to get uh, to get the best convenience, uh, we'd better use this project or this repository. So thank you for this order first. Then we will jump into, into this uh, repository. Uh, we will try to say if we can, you know, run it and uh, and maybe do some training about it because at most of the time, if we want to get some fun, we would like to use our own database than the default one. Okay, at the first, we have to clone this repository. Let's do it. Okay, after that, we go into that repository. This is the content. Then we do something sudo pep3 install r requirements. Okay, we are done here. This said you can pre train the model using simple data available in repository, or you can download the data using this one. It seems like it only got. Uh, got the text data. So you don't have any pre-trained model, you have to train it by yourself. Okay, then uh, let's train it by ourselves. First, we have to find out where the data located was located, where the data was located. And you would say uh, generally it's in this folder. It's in data script folder. Okay, then we uh we, we do this. We do it with a simple command. Uh we will shake the vocabulary size to a smaller value, for example, five hundred. Let's do it. Oh uh, we should use Python three. Okay, it seems like it's uh, it's working for some reason, and it's done. Pre-processing is done, so that's only the the pre-processing. Uh, then we will have to train it. Um, yes, let's 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 try train it. Hit the enter, and it start to. Train this stuff, and it seems like yeah, it's it's working. And as we can say, after the training, we can open the sequence generator that ipynb file uh, to get a start to to get a start to use this uh, uh, to use our model. Okay, we can have a look at this. Uh, after the training, we will get a file lambda model. Then we can load that uh, stuff by using this command from simple import sequence generator. And we give it a content, which is a sentence that we, uh, we, we have previously. Then this function will generate the following sentence that it thinks that may be useful to you. So th this is how we use the GPT-2. It's quite simple, right? I won't do this training while I recording this tutorial because um, it seems like I, I couldn't do that because I don't have enough memory to do that. Okay, that's today's tutorial. I'll see you in the next one. Or someday.